Hello, welcome to another episode of Kerbal Space Program's Stupid Ideas. Now, this is a short episode. It's about four minutes long. And of course, the uh, stupidity of the idea is inversely proportional to the length of the video. So yeah, you can see I'm building a frame here. And this frame is for a vehicle called Seppo Rocket. Now, the idea was the the engine that has the highest thrust to mass ratio in the game is not a mainsail or a skipper or any of those big engines, it's the Sepotrons. They have uh, a small amount of thrust but an absolutely tiny amount of mass to go with it, so you know I have seen um, challenges where you can use the infinite fuel cheat to get to the moon in like 10 minutes or less than 10 minutes by using these sepatrons. Um, because you know you can have them providing the most ridiculous amount of thrust for their weight. But my idea was to see just exactly how feasible they are without the infinite fuel cheat. So here I am building a frame just uh, out of the girders which are reasonably light. Um, and yeah, just sticking thousands of separatrons to it. And this is in four times speed because you better believe this was tedious. <laughs> I I just cannot overstate just how tedious this was. I didn't even stick as many on as I wanted. Um, I mean it wouldn't have been so bad, I don't mind stuff like this. Uh, but you can probably just see the jerkiness of it there. And yeah, I was getting a pretty abysmal frame rate. And here it is. Yeah, I've left this loading screen in. This is four times acceleration. Loading. <laughs> loading. Yeah, it took a while. It really struggled with all those parts. That's pretty much why this video is so short. Because, <laughs> yeah. I mean, I think there's uh, probably over a thousand sepatrons on there, I don't know. But look! It goes pretty damn fast! We put it up on there and... Oh! Yeah. It's not structurally sound though. And this is not a slideshow. This is what I was seeing at four times acceleration right now. But And yeah, it was... Uh, the space center was basically just Beirut <laughs> after this. It it just started raining sepatrons like just incendiary devices. Uh, yeah, that's uh, that's some interesting physics there. They're still attached to that little probe thing in the middle. And I don't quite know how, but they're still attached by some magical force. And, yep, lots of little explosions. Oh, and there it goes. Crashing to the ground. Quite spectacularly. Oh, yes. So, that was a stupid idea. Thank you for watching.